Yeah, training for the, the 100 is uh, unique. Uh, we've got experience from the challenges we've done in the past. Obviously, it involves a lot of swimming, a lot of biking, a lot of running, a lot of strength training, and a massive emphasis on recovery and nutrition. To be able to have a swim spa here at my house eases the complexity of training because it's so time consuming to do everything that needs to be done to get ready for a challenge like this. It is more than a full-time job. So if I can eliminate travel to the gym, travel back, all of those things that involve getting to a pool and swimming to be able to do it, lock it in 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minute session right here at my home, that saves me a ton of time and gets me closer and quicker to the recovery part of training, which legit is the most important part for me. These big challenges all surround and really hinge on how well I can adapt and recover to the stresses. So recovery right at the top of uh, my priority list as far as training is concerned. Yeah, we've got a pretty good protocol for post uh, event every single day on the 100. Uh, we're gonna be utilizing the, the spa to really loosen up the muscles to try to warm my core temperature up on those cold days get loose before my therapist will come in and, and really, really stretch me out and uh, get me ready for the next day. So swim spa is gonna be critical in my recovery process every single day. And then we're gonna do all the other things, nutrition and stretching and everything inside the house to get ready. It's a, it's a big ask. Recovery is super important.